teen tune was hanging in Sean's basement when Ico suddenly socked him with a nasty cliffhanger. <laughs> I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You write the scripts. I mean, I don't know yet. I get it. It's a two-part cliffhanger episode. You don't want to ruin the ending for us. You genius, you. There's no second part. There's no ending. I have writer's block. Don't toy with me like that. I mean, you can think of something. Anything. It's, it's easy. You have any ideas? What about an octopus? And he went and grabbed... An acorn-obsessed lumberjack. And then he went crazy... It's like my mind is completely blank. See? And he goes. No. Guys, we gotta get this finished today. Our viewers are expecting it. I got it. Just relax. Just give me a little brain massage. We have to get those creative ideas flowing. No, 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 no. I got it. That's sickles. I got it! Wheat germ, tofu, seaweed, cactus, garlic powder, olive oil, and a pinch of sawdust. Here, drink it up. Thanks. This is a bowl to help my creativity? No, I just wanted to see if you could drink it. It's okay. You still got the end of the day to think of something. No pressure, just the expectations of thousands of fans. <laughs> Me too. Let's look at this problem. Okay, let's see. First step is to subtract one from both sides of the equation. Anything you do on one side of the equation, you must do on the other side. Isn't that nice? A nice, balanced equation is pretty as a sunset. What if? Psycho Squirrel ate radioactive acorns. And then he grew a thousand feet tall, he drank all the water in the oceans, and then he ate the whole earth. It's been done. Well, you gotta figure something out soon. School's almost over. I got it. What? You have an idea? What is it? Yeah, stop talking. I can see it all in my head. No distractions. Once she dreamed of another planet that was just hers, with no rules and nothing set in stone, just water. Look, I know you want to make a difference somehow, but this is a big deal. I want to make decisions that have an impact. So, Mom, what do you think? Coach Dan, um, can I be excused from swim practice today? Why? Um, well, I suffer from s pool sickness. It's kind of like seasickness, but with a lot more vomiting. I had a kid vomit in the pool once. It spread everywhere like a horrible, jumpy oil slick. 
The other kids couldn't see it. They tried yelling, but it was no use. They, they swam right into it. All of them. I'll never forgive myself for Black Tuesday. I think I'm gonna pass out. Uh, let me get my student manager to, to give you a hand, okay? Uh, Greg, uh, help I go to the bleachers, will you? I gotta go somewhere else. Thank you for your kindness. Whatever. Yeah, I could have been on the junior all world diving team, but I was too busy doing volunteer modeling work. How noble of you. you! Guys, this is it. I got gold over here. Good job, Michael. Keep it up. Watch and learn, Chunks. Hey, Ash, this one's for you. That was terrible! This is how I'm stuck. category. Ladies and gentlemen, but especially ladies, you might want to move a little bit closer to witness this. Write them down. <gasps> I was in the zone. Then let's get that notebook back. Team Tune. Psycho Squirrel. Psycho, Psycho, Psycho Squirrel. <laughs> 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 Let's stop. Men's diving. You know, it's kind of fun underwater. Maybe we could turn this into a week-long cruise. No one would bother us down here, and we could just hang out and talk and, you know, get to know each other. No time, Manmobile. We gotta find Arco's notebook. Any sign of it? No. We're getting something on sonar! What is it? I have no idea, but it's big and it's coming at us fast! I'll put it up on the screen. Hundred feet? Hang on! Fifty feet! Sam, I think it's a good time to let you know that I was the one who put the rotting fish in your locker. What? Forty! That was you? I had to hire a cleaning service! Sorry, dude. Thirty! Oh, and I also switched your shampoo with hair dye. I wanted to get that off my chest, too. Twenty! I think that's it. Uh-oh. Looks 
like the SS Animobile is about to become the catch of the day. Uh, ow, get those things away from me! Uh, watch it! Oh, that hurt! Evasive maneuvers! Somewhere. I think we're safe. Prepare for manual exploration. We're going out. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Something I don't know. Oh, I found something. What is that? I don't know. It's stuck to something. No, no way! Don't! Ew! It's a blue hairball. Which was the only thing plugging that drain? Disgusting. That ought to teach you not to touch nasty things. Make waves! Go! Uh-oh. Looks like this episode's going down the drain. Oh, Tizzy. I'm getting all dizzy just watching this. Say that again. Gross. <laughs> Definitely not human. Or animal. This looks like monster hair. Baggy taggy. Case of the missing notebook. Clue number one. Blue hairball. That's the ink for my pen. Someone took my notebook from out of the pool. Let's go! Team 2! What was that? It came from that locker. Hugs? Is that you? That's funny. Little help. Yeah. Yeah.
Yesterday, I saw a dog wearing little sneakers on his paws and a tiny hat on his head. No, have you seen anything weird in the past few minutes in this room? I don't know. I see a lot of weird things. Maybe that's why I was cowering in fear inside that locker. All right, fine. Yeah, I saw a hairy guy. Big two. He's heading towards the gym. Thanks, Fox. Forgetting something? Whoa, 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 whoa. No. Come on, like you mean it. There you go. That's it. Picking something up. Wow. <laughs> Guys, that's not good. <sighs> Let's go, guys. Guy, we don't want any problems. We're just looking for my notebook. Do you have it? No! Oh! Yeah. Anyone have a hanky? So is that a yes or a no? What can I do for you guys? Did you happen to find my notebook that fell into the pool? No. But I did find this wet piece of paper on my desk. That's for my notebook. Let me see this. Please? Something something. Excuse? Something something. A. Any of you know what that means? That's not what it says. It says, please bake pears with fat and cake. No, no, you're saying things. It says, and in the beer switch, zim zim. I think it's. Crispy, juicy, tender is chill like vibe mood feels. Mickey D's crispy chicken sandwich. Russian. Bag and tag it. Clue number two, loose page. There's fingerprints from hands covered in dirt. 
What does that mean? There's only one place where you can find that notebook. Follow me. Looks like we've all learned a lesson here. Always remember to wash your hands. No one in the school will leave that much dirt on a piece of paper. But someone who loves playing in dirt might. <laughs> You could consider my ideas as valuable as treasure, but I'll let the critics decide that. No one steals my treasure! Relax, little man. No one's here to steal your treasure. And even if you were, what's a pipsqueak like you gonna do about it? Oh! That was totally unnecessary! I'm not gonna ask oh. again. Can't a man get a hanky around here? You're going down! Yeah! Let's teach him to pick on someone his own size. Tiny. Wait, guys, don't! What is? Stop getting bigger. Chew on this. The swim team manager, I knew we would find you here. You're not gonna take me back to the pool. You think it's easy being the swim team manager? Every day, breathing in chlorine and getting pruned fingers? No, we don't. So what if I love dirt? If it's okay to jump in water, why isn't it okay to jump in dirt? It doesn't make any sense. Ah, Earth. Dude, we're not here to bring you back. Or judge you. We just want to know if you found a notebook by the pool. Oh, yeah. I've got it. I used one of the pages to fake a note excusing me from swim class. And it was written in Russian, right? Here it is. Still a little wet. Oh. Oh. Looks like we'll be putting on another rerun this week. Wait, no. I can read this. Squiggly, squaggly, squiggly. Boo. That doesn't seem like something Psycho Square would say. It's no use. It's ruined. Dudes, it's fine. This whole adventure has given me an even better idea for this episode. Guys, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell anyone about this, especially the flippers. Hey, kid, your secret's safe with me and all our viewers. Team 2! Psycho, Psycho, Psycho Scare!
Another masterpiece. What can I say? I'm a poet. Play it again. Another successful Team Tune episode. <laughs> and it was totally worth the wait. Up next on Kicks, Team 2.